Well, many of us enjoy spending time binge watching our favorite TV shows. And today, registered dietitian Amy Breganini from Mercy Health is here to help us get through that with some healthy snacks. Because I think one of the things most of us find that we're guilty of is just taking the big bag of popcorn and just doing this because you get so engrossed in what you're doing and then it's gone and you've consumed like 1200 calories. Yep, absolutely. I've been binge watching my favorite programs lately and I find the same thing. If I sit down with a bag, I it's gone. And mm -hmm. there's what, 1200, 1300 calories right there. So I like um, I like having pre-portioned opportunities, but I also like veggie based right. snacks. Right. Because it just is a lot, I can eat more for less calories, mm -hmm. right? And you've got some really good um, ways to make that happen and, and have people kind of think a little bit differently when it comes to snacking. Are those the veggie sticks that come in the bag? Those are, well, they're snap peas. So okay. kind of like the veggie sticks, you can have 22 of them for 130 calories. Oh, wow. So it's a lot better than potato chips and they've got a good crunch. Um, same thing with the homemade kale chips. Mm -hmm. A lot of people uh, have s said that they want to eat more kale and these are just honestly the easiest thing you ever do. You just wash them, dry them, and then put a little olive oil and bake them. I still have not developed a, a taste for the kale chips, but some people love them, yeah. and for those who do, that's great. I wish I could get there, yep. <laughs> maybe well, someday. You know, you could someday. Also, an alternative, I think, that tastes even a little bit better than the kale chips are the um, sweet... Um, Chickpeas. Mm -hmm. So baked. And how chickpeas. do you season yours? Yep, I use cayenne pepper and a little bit of garlic salt, and that okay. was it. And it's not you put them in the oven, right, to get them um, crunchy, but not. It doesn't take that long. No, it does. It was like probably 20 minutes. Oh I my think. gosh. Yeah. Okay. Super, yeah. And super then you easy. feel fuller because there's protein in there. Absolutely. Protein yeah. and fiber. Same thing. Yep. And this is homemade veggie dip with oh. just a little Greek yogurt. Okay. And some um, herbs and spices, or a little cayenne pepper in there for a little heat. Now, did you? What kind of herbs and spices? Because you can buy the packaged stuff, and sometimes that's where you go terribly wrong. Where just because you're making it with Greek yogurt doesn't make it really that much healthier. Well said, yes. Actually, my uh, my had parsley, cayenne pepper, a little garlic, and then just the veggies. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. So it's just a nice variety. I think, again, um, a good way to low calorie way to fill you up. Mm -hmm, and same thing sure. with the apple slices. You get a good um, a lot of fiber with that. And then there was just a little caramel on the uh -huh. top or some sweetness. And it, it's a nice alternative if you want something sweet because some people like the sweet stuff instead of the crunchy when they're watching. Yeah. Um, rice cakes. You know, you forget about those. They were really big in like the 90s. Everybody was eating them. They, I think everybody was on the rice cake diet. Yeah. <laughs> everybody was eating them and making fun of them right, <laughs> at think. the same time. So you can just add a little hummus to the top of them and then that will add a little of the protein and healthy fat. Mm -hmm. So and then the last thing would just be the popcorn. I right. love popcorn. It's super easy. You can make it yourself and little little to no fat, just a little salt on top. Yeah. And so these are all really great ways to sort of like find that portion control, find that way. And then I think what it does mostly is when you portion it out and you eat it and it's gone and you realize that you've gone through it like this, I think you find out um, how much you're eating, number one, number two, yep. what portion sizes really are. Agreed. And I, sometimes it can just reset your mind, not just for when you're watching TV, but when you're going throughout your day as well. I agree 100%. Yeah, it's just a nice way to fill up without filling up. <laughs> yeah, for sure. All right. Thanks so much, Amy. Of course, we've put this information on our website, 13onyourside.com.